Hey friends, welcome to the Manitoba Museum Science Gallery. My name is Adriana and I love to do science experiments uh, here in the science zone. And today, you know, we're getting into that summery time. I'm sure we're all excited for those warm months. And I'm sure all of us really enjoy having a sweet, cold glass of lemonade. Now, some of you might make lemonade by taking some powder, pouring it into a cup, and usually, you want to add some water to this so that you can make a really nice juice. But if I add some water to my powder, um, I don't know about you guys, but this doesn't really look like the kind of lemonade you might drink at home because uh, my lemonade doesn't usually hang up upside down. And that's because this isn't actually lemonade, it's called hydrophilic powder. So hydrophilic powder are these little grains that really love water. It's in the name. Hydro means water and philic means it really likes something. So the little grains of this powder loves water and when it comes into contact with it, it actually absorbs the water and expands. So it turns into this kind of like solid, almost slush feeling like material. Now, you're probably thinking, this is kind of cool, but it doesn't really apply to me. I've never seen it in my life. But you would be wrong, because I'm sure all of you have used one of these guys before. Now, this, of course, is a diaper, a brand new clean one that has never been used. Now, this diaper is actually filled with hydrophilic powder. So inside, there's all that powder inside, which is really, really small. But when you fill it with water, it expands. And you're probably thinking, this is a small diaper. It might not hold that much, but you would be surprised. I'm going to get my friend Justine here to actually help me. So say hi, Justine. Hello. She is going to help pour water into my diaper. So I'll hold on to it. Um, right. And do you want to grab the water? Absolutely. So we have a beaker of 400 milliliters, and we're going to test it out. And to make sure that it's hol holding all the water, I am going to dump the diaper over top of Justine's head to see if she gets soaked or if it's the diaper has absorbed all the water and she stays dry. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's get started. So let's start pouring and we'll kind of swish it around back and forth. And 400 milliliters is a lot of water. So we have to give it a second to absorb up. Now, diapers are great, right? So I'm sure your parents don't want you as a baby peeing your pants every single day and having that liquid everywhere. So diapers help absorb the liquid so that it doesn't get everywhere. All right, you good? Ready? And three, two, one. Completely dry. You can actually see the diaper has absorbed it all. And if I rip it open, you can see the hydrophilic powder inside. Look at that slushy, wonderful material that's very fun to poke. Now, if you want to try this at home and you have a diaper, make sure you ask your parents first because diapers are expensive. So please don't take one without asking. But if you have one and your parents say it's okay, take a diaper, add some water, and see how that slush powder feels like. And please don't ever put it in your mouth or on your eyes or anything like that. If you're playing with the slush powder, do it in front of an adult with supervision and throw it out in the garbage after. All right, thanks guys for visiting. I hope you had fun with this science experiment and have a great summer.